Hello, my name is Professor Graham Hitman and I work here at Barts and the London Queen Mary University of London. Now I'm the project coordinator of a brand new programme funded by the European Commission called GIFTS. Now what is GIFTS? GIFTS is an opportunity to look at prevention of diabetes in South Asian communities but unusually what we're focusing on is very early life and that starts from conception through to pregnancy into the first few years of life. We see this is a unique opportunity in which we can help with diet and lifestyle and prevent and slow down this massive epidemic of obesity and type 2 diabetes. Why are we focusing on South Asians? Well, in South Asians, there's a massive prevalence of diabetes. This is three to six times the prevalence of most European communities. Not only that, if we take people over the age of 20, one in four have diabetes or pre-diabetes. In the GIFT study, we're working on a range of different disciplines to try and understand the causes of obesity and diabetes. Some of the studies are very focused on science, and my colleague here, Mel, is a molecular biologist, and she's working on some DNA samples from the study to try and understand the causes of obesity. We're also taking these studies into the clinics, in the hospital and out into the community to understand much more about patients who have obesity and diabetes and what we can do to help them. And then the final thing is to work with uh, communities and try and develop some strategies around preventing diabetes and obesity. So for South Asian people, we know that they have certain genes that can increase their chances of getting these diseases. But we also know that perhaps their bodies are designed to be living in a environment where there's some poverty and there's some nutritional deprivation and then when those people move to either cities in Asia or over here to the UK or other European countries where food is very plentiful people can drive around in their cars and not be very active there's a kind of mismatch between their way the way the genes are designed to work and their environments and we think it's those combination of factors that probably gives you a very high, high chance of developing obesity and diabetes So with the knowledge that we're going to learn from the GIFTS programme, I as a doctor working here at Barts Health am going to be able to advise my pregnant patients so much better about how to prevent diabetes and obesity in the future, whether that be through increasing the amount of exercise they're doing or improving their diet. What do we want to get out at the end of this project? Well, what we really want to understand is the gene-environment interaction. If we can get a handle on both the inherited predisposition, how different people change in comparison to different interventions, and if we know that by intervening in pregnancy that we can start to reduce the prevalence of diabetes, then we've achieved something. And of course, the last thing is, is understanding in the South Asian community who will come and if it's all acceptable. If we can do that, we've done very well. <laughs>